Hello everyone, Prince of Persia here. Welcome back to another part of Witcher 3 playthrough. Last time we talked to the pillar here and we figured out uh, about the baby that was miscarried. And uh, now we need to talk to the Baron to advance that quest. But before that, I actually decided to take up the uh, other quest, hey there. Uh, hunting a witch, because it's a lower level one. So uh, let's uh, start working on that one, actually. One more left here. Let's take care of that. Come on. There's actually two. And they're done. So we can continue. There are a few drowners here as well. Let's take care of them. Damn, you're up. And another one. Do I already? Let's just check what we find here. There's a note. And we're done. We cannot continue on our way. Looks like there's a quest over here. Or at least an interaction. Reaper is the only one you'll talk to. Slow now. Whoa. Okay. Let's see about this. What did this man do to you? Him? Nothing. Appeared in the village. Looking to trade his ring for some bread. But we've no food. None. Because of the black ones. Trampled our fields. Raided our granaries. Burnt our orchards. So instead of bread, he'll get a noose. Please, good folk, do you not have ears? I did not want this war. I have deserted to go home to my wife and child. Take everything I have, but spare my life. Just let him go. Let him go. Oh, sure. And maybe give him some fixings for the journey. Saddle up a horse for him. Black one showed us no mercy. We show them none in return. Tried it the nice way. Gotta try something different. Okay, that's 
Scheiße noch. for peasants. But now I had enough. Okay, let's go free him. Thank you. If you had not come. If I'd not come, only one man would have died. Really going back to your wife? Yes. She bore a child just before the war started. A girl. I named her Beatrice, after her grandmother. Why? Why did you help me? Lynch mobs. Nothing good ever comes of them. Now go. Stay off the high roads and give any villages a wide berth until you cross the Aruga. Okay. Let's continue on our way. Let's take a look at this. Get rid of the rest. like now we have to deal with the big one this is gonna be hard I'm thinking
finally. Let's continue on our way. There are a few bandits here. Let's deal with them. Don't let up! Sorry, man. That's the last of them. Let's continue. Get him! And Come another on. bandit jam. This one didn't take long. Let's continue. Well, we are at the village. Now we take need to easy. talk to people to find the witch that we're looking for. Hi, Hi you. Mum said if I'm good, she'll send me on the trailer the trips. Might toss us some grub then. Don't want to hear that. I've never visit the witch myself. I've my oh. own, thank the gods. And for the rest, like well, she can't beat bread from you stone either. Oh, oh, come on, this new one's not half bad. Sharp tongue on her, but she helps when there's a need. She can't fill our guts with spells. Besides, she got no warts. She's not cross-eyed. And what's a witch with no grey on her head? Not much likely to be inside it. For one who never sees her, you seem to know a heap about her. I know what they say. Don't care much myself, but when folk talk, I listen. Well, they're talking about the witch, so let's see if they know anything. Should send him back to the witch. Might cure him of laziness. Greetings, ma'am. Good day to you, sir. Need something? Got a matter for your village witch. Know where I can find her? I don't bother with her myself. But ask my man. He'll know. Twerked his back so bad last week he could hardly move. So I sent him to the witch. Came back sprightly as a foal. Where is he? In the yard, no doubt. Pain's gone, but sleuth's setting now. Should be hunting foxberries to feed our young ones. Marion's lad, and that man, he knows how to provide for his family. Lots of water rats last. They had food for days. Let's talk to her husband. Good day. Heard you know where to find the local witch. Who told you that? Your wife. Daft wench. Leave me be and don't listen to that nattering sow. We've not had a witch, shaman, nor cunning wench in ages. Okay, I don't have time for this. You sure? Give it a think. Won't take no for an answer, will ye? Ooh, all right. Know the small pond near the village? Path leads off from it. Follow that till you come across a lone rock. Walk around that, then to the woods. Find the old cart. You're there. Thanks. It's just... Don't harm her, sir. Word of your kind's reached these parts. My kind, meaning? Well, the witch-burning kind. Witch hunters have been here already? Nay. But we've heard tell of him. So, when I spied you coming, swords and all, straight away, I thought tales must be true. I'm a witcher, not a witch hunter. Hmm? What? Not one and the same? No. 
No need to worry. I'm not out to hurt your witch. Ooh, a weight off me heart, sir. She only arrived a short while ago, but she's frightfully wise. Even pleasant on the eyes. I feel like I'm skinny. Thanks for your help. Farewell. Well, let's go and find the witch. There's the boulder. Now right, and on to the cart. Looks like we ran into some trouble. You're gonna make me wait. all of them let's continue actually before going any further i think i have enough uh, to make a blue mutagen and then if we go to our character page we can assign that and get 28 percent sign intensity from there so now let's continue our way. the card which is hut is somewhere nearby. Miss, the cows are wheezing, won't rise from the barn floor, pus streams from her snout. Do I look like a dairy maid to you? No, Miss, but you know things. Tis our last cow, none other left in the village. Rest died of hunger. Or soldiers let him off. Oh, we're as good as dead without her. I shall give you herbs. Mix them with water drawn from the spring at midnight, then make the cow drink them. But first, you must clean out your barn. Thoroughly. Is that clear? Thank you, miss. A thousand thanks. Enough. I've had my fill for the day. Go home. Okay. Let's She's go in and, and we best come talk back to the on witch. The Watch what you say. She's quick to iron. Have to take her hand. Ordinary ointment. Nothing special. Now, where's she run off to? Leads to the basement. Let's check that out. Nothing important here. Let's head back up. Don't often see bubbles like this in Velen. Aura must be some artifact or so this is where she disappeared to. Okay, here's a portal. Let's see where it leads. Well, well, nice. I was wondering 
how long it would take you, Geralt. I'm upstairs. Don't be shy. Greetings, Witcher. Just a spot. Hmm. Where? Hope you didn't come to court. No. To talk. Turn around and wait. Kira Metz deep in the heart of Velen. Thought you hated the countryside. I can assure you I do. Now more than ever. Heard a witch lived out here. Never would have guessed it was King Foltest's former advisor. I'm so pleased the world's still able to astound you, Geralt. I actually envy you that sense of wonder. Common in children, knights errant, and morons. Mm, someone's grown irritable. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I believe I greeted you with a pleasant view. Now tell me what brings you here. So, bet you saw this question coming. What are you doing here? Let me think. Enjoying the country air? Admiring the unspoilt scenery? Or is it furthering the age-old alliance between the city and its breadbasket? No. I'm in hiding, Geralt. Blind to the state of the world? Don't you see what's happening? You mean the persecution mages now face? Yes, that's exactly what I mean. Radovid's new pastime. Pursuing anyone with a whiff of magic about them. Witch hunters. Sound familiar? Murderers scouring the north from end to end. Burning books, hanging soothsayers, torturing herbalists. Picked a strange place to hide. I didn't pick anything. In the north, Radovid's men hunt sorceresses like fish in a barrel. Nilfgaard controls the south. Where was I to flee? Emperor does keep mages on a short leash, but he lets them live and ply their trade. Radovid and Emma differ in every respect except one. They share a deep hatred of the Lodge of Sorceresses. And I was a member. So how's it feel to be the village witch? <sighs> Horrid. No joy in having the boundless respect and trust of the local peasantry? <laughs> They'd respect anyone who could produce hemorrhoid cream. Been here a while, haven't you? Long enough for rot to set in. You cannot possibly imagine how much I detest this place. Changing the subject. Any news of your sisters from the lodge? None. We can't know too much about one another these days. It's safer that way. Even tried to contact one another? I've wanted to many times. But I've no way of knowing who would answer. Or who might be listening. I'm looking for a certain young woman. Oh really? Who? Looking for Siri. That Siri. And no one can know, understand? Cyrilla is here. The girl once sought by the Lodge of Sorceresses, and practically every ruler on the continent has landed here in Velen, and I know nothing of it. What is she doing here? Indications are she's hiding from someone. I heard she quarreled with a witch, but if you don't know anything, sure you haven't seen her? I'm certain I haven't. But recently, someone asked me about an ashen-haired woman. He claimed she would stand out from the peasant crowd. Who was it? <laughs> Not so fast, Geralt. No humble plea. No offering for the witch. My undying gratitude. Good enough. It's nothing to sneeze at. 
But you've a knack for getting into trouble. I should probably ask for something more immediately deliverable. Oh, sod it. Don't give me that look. I know it's Siri we're talking about. It was an elf, this individual who asked about Cyrilla. No flea-bitten Scoyotel slob either, but an elven mage. What was an elven mage doing in Velen? Well, I tried to ask him, of course, about everything. Of course. Oh, but you know how elves are. He asked many more questions than he answered. He say what his name was? He didn't. And he wore a mask. Very secretive all around, but I liked him. He was intelligent and composed. He say what he wanted with Siri? Only that they were to meet in Velen. He wished to know if she'd arrived before he did. He leave any message for her? No, but he asked that were I to meet her, I should lead her to him. So you know where to find him? Yes, he said he found a hideout in some elven ruins near the village of Midcops. I'll go there with you. Why? Think I'll have trouble finding this place? I have unfinished business with this elf. He promised me something, but he never delivered it. Besides, I know you think as I do, that she might be there. And I'd like to see Cyrilla too. Let's go then. Yes, let's. This is the place. Been here before? No. I was hoping the elf would return as he'd promised or else his waif would appear. At any rate, I've no idea what to expect from this place. Well, let's find out. Well, Come on. we made good progress in this part. And we can continue in the next one with this quest. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. And I'll see you guys in the next part.